after Rakai was met up with you, actually that was the, the, the spirit of the Lord trying to knock, but you didn't open the door. And then you, you talked with Elder Tahar. That was the spirit of the Lord knocking, knocking on your hard ass head, man. But you ain't open the door. That's how, because Yahweh Shah ain't going to come down here itself and ring your doorbell or whatever apartment 818H or something like that. No, he, he's going to work through his men. He's going to send his men, which, it, which are the counsel of the Lord, like the scriptures say in Proverbs, which you have said at naught. All right? So when, when the brothers were sitting there talking to you and as you're watching these videos, guess what, stupid? That's the Lord knocking on, on your door. Right. It says, um, it says, uh, it says, um, I will come into him and will sup with him and he with me. So in other words, the Lord, when he not, if, if you listen to the instruction that the Lord has given you, he will come into your, into your mind and sup with you, meaning he would, he, he'll break bread with you. You know, he'll show you the scriptures, he'll show you the mysteries and the breakdowns, you know? You know, and he'll give you the understanding. But if you if you harden your neck, like it says in, in uh, Proverbs 29, he that being often reproved hardeneth his neck, afterwards shall be destroyed. Because the Lord has given you warning. He's, he's, he's long-suffering. Oh, thing, um, now we did a documentary. It was been up all week. The, I believe the last part was put up yesterday, uh, which was called What is the uh, Mark of the Beast? And um, it's about 70... Like 75 minutes long It's cut up into six parts Anyway um, That clearly shows you that uh, The mark of the beast Is the microchip And you're dead set against that man So you're being a You're being an ultimate demon man That's why we said you sell, sold out man And we know Johanna sold out Yeah because behind closed doors You can say certain things But in public you can't that's why we admitted a whole bunch of stuff to Elder Rakar, but you won't admit that in public. Well, that's a hypocrite. You know, yeah, so you're being a hypocrite. Well, you're a demon, you know, that's why you don't proclaim the name of the Lord, you know, out openly, you know, and if you do do it, you do it in a sarcastic uh, manner, you know, taking the name of the Lord in vain, you know, but there's certain things you can't say. It's the book of Amos, chapter 5, verse 12. For I know your manifold transgressions and your mighty sins. They afflict the just. They take a bribe and they turn aside the poor and the gate from their right. Yeah, a 501c3, that's a bribe, man. Yep. You know, that's a bribe because there's a, um, there's a information out there that you don't have to take a 501c3 to conduct a, 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 a congregation. Yep, be you know, tax you. Free, uh, tax free. Yeah, you took it, Nate, because number one, you ain't got faith and number two like we've been saying throughout the lesson is you love your slave master yep and um yeah you do the bidding of your slave master esau you know and the reason why you did that was to open the door up for you to get grants all right and because your people you know your your people want to know that you're legit you're legit meaning are you with the white man do you have some type of i want to see your credentials from the United States government, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, we just going, we going with the, in the spirit, man. Right. We right. going in the spirit. Like, like the real prophets do. Like the real prophets did, man. Yeah. The, pro, the, 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 the apostles didn't ask for favors from the government, from the Roman authorities, man. That's right. They were bidden to pay, pay their taxes and they paid it. Right. And the Lord had to tell them, you got to pay it because they didn't want to pay it. And the Lord said, what's the, uh, the uh, image and the uh, subscription uh, and uh, the um, superscription, excuse me, on the coin. He said, Caesar. He said, well, render unto Caesar's, that is Caesar's, and unto the most high, the most, most high. Okay? All right, go ahead. Yeah. This is uh, <laughs> the book of Galatians 1, 11, and 12. Now, this is what, well, I'll start at 10. This is what Paul said. For do I now persuade men or the heavenly father? Or do, do I seek to please men for if I yet please men, I should not be the servant of Yahweh Shai. The fact that you got that 501c3, like the, like the elder said, you wanted to get those credentials for what? To please men. But I Because your zombies want to see something. Can't. They want to see something <clears throat> official. You know? Yeah. It, it has to be in good standing with the white man, <laughs> your slave master. Uh, the 11th verse, it says, But I certify you, 
brethren, that the gospel which was preached of me is not after man. Yeah, this thing of ours is spiritual, man. It's a spiritual thing. We don't need no goddamn 501c3 from the fucking white man, all right? This is a spiritual thing. And the so-called white man is not spiritual, all right? Uh, the 12 verse, for I neither received it of man, neither was I taught it, but by the revelation of Yahweh Shai. So there it is, man. The, what we have is because a lot of people say, well, how do you know? And how can you prove? Uh, look, this knowledge that we receive, we received it by the revelation of Yahweh Shai through our elders. That's all you need to know, you people out there. That's all you know. Well, That's all we're you not talking to you people that got to question things, man. Yeah, con. We're, uh, our job is to push this word out. So it can get to the elect. We're not concerned right. about any of the other two thirds. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so that's our answer to you. You know, how do you know? And then in the book of Romans uh, three and three, it says, "For what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of the heavenly Father without effect?" You know what that means? Just because you don't believe, is that going to stop the prophecies that are written in the Bible? The answer is no. It's going to keep rolling on, man. The Bible says America's going to go down in destruction. Guess what? America's going down in destruction. Which Nate doesn't believe that. All right? The that. Bible says he that. He hadn't taught a class on that. That's right. That's right. The, that's right. the Bible says. teaching about uh, bouts with depression. <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you, man? Yeah, like, like you're some kind of psychiatrist. That's why you got all them zombies, man. All your, yeah. all your men are zombies, man. Every time I see, <laughs> see a, a, one of your videos and I don't see you there, yeah. I just see zombies and shit lurking out in the streets. Yeah, like, like you're trying to sound like you're Dr. Oz or yeah, yeah. what's that other guy? Uh, Dr. Phil. Dr. Phil, you know, like you got the white smock with your name, a little tag with your name on it. This is not what this is about, man. You know? Oh, well, yeah. that nigga, when he does his classes, he got that long uh, 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 ram's horn and written on it is his name. All, all show. It's all about him, man. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the Nate show. You the know? Nate show. Yeah. Yeah. You have the, you have the props. Just like when you watch any any so-called talk talking show, they always have the props. You know, he might have a stuffed panda <laughs> or, or, or a stuffed. Well, he does have a stuffed panda. <laughs> Look at the fool sitting next to him. Yeah, what's up? That's that's the stuffed panda. You know, they they have the little they have the pictures. If it's a black show, you know, you might have a picture with with uh, Angela Davis with a fist in the air. You know. <laughs> If it's a black, if this forum is about black people, you'll have your typical bongo in the background. <laughs> You're a joke, Nate, man. <laughs> you better get with the program, man. You, you better get with the program. Anyway, anyway. That's right, man. It's reality. And I know you're going to come back, man. You gonna watch this? You well, you you said you watch all our videos. Yeah, he watched. I hope, I, saw, I hope you saw the the new documentary on the six six six, man. Cause you in it. I made your ass famous, man. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Anyway, let's go to hey. Hey, you have a little fun, man. Hey, uh, Barack, uh, the Baruch, Barack, Baruch, a uh, four fifteen on down to twenty five, and then we're gonna close on that. Baruch, chapter four. Verses, I'm sorry, 14 to 25. Baruch chapter 4, verse 14. Let, come. Let them that dwell about Zion come and remember ye the captivity of my sons and daughters, which the everlasting hath brought upon them. Now, the Most High is making you remember it with these movies, man. 12 years a slave. Uh, 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 Django Unchained. Roots, Mandingo, Drum. <laughs> 